There is something you don't know about Brawl Stars bots. Although the earliest sighting of bots date back to 2020, today in 2023, bots have slowly become more relevant. And by the way, I'm not talking about the normal bots like Bot 1 in practice matches. This is actually something more sinister. Players often bot out, they turn into bots after a period of inactivity, but I'm not even talking about them. The bots we'll be addressing in this video are legitimate 100% AI controlled bots that you are definitely playing against, maybe without even knowing it. If you've been playing Brawl for a while, you'll be familiar with the previous common occurrence of bots in lower trophy games. You pick up a new brawler, start using it in games, and it's quite easy because you're literally not playing with real players. And it's like that for most matches until the brawler reaches rank 20. At least, that's how it was supposed to be. Also, for anyone who might be wondering, a bot is simply a character that is controlled by a computer instead of a human, hence the term bot, meaning robot. Most people already know how bots used to work, but this method is slowly becoming a problem. Bots are becoming more prominent. One example of this is they now appear in higher trophy ranges. This kind of beats the purpose. The initial purpose of bots was to make the game easy and fair for beginners. Nowadays, players can face full matches of bots even when playing with a respectable amount of trophies. Mm. It's almost like bots are losing their purpose and are just appearing wherever, whenever. However, there seems to be a pattern. In 2023, I could be playing with a brawler, anywhere from 500 to 800 trophies, and I'll find that I'm playing against bots. But here's the thing, this only occurs after a series of losses. It seems Supercell implemented this feature to prevent losing streaks, which could lead to their players tilting. But even this is getting out of hand and the number of matches you play against bots seems to have increased. And in my opinion, other games do this better. Even Clash Royale for example. Don't quote me on this, I'm more of a brawl guy, but I believe Clash Royale has this losing pool system. When a player starts tilting, they will then be matched up with another player who's also lost their last few matches. This stops one of the players losing streaks, causing them to play another match and another match, they play the game for longer, invest more into it, super might make more money, everyone's happy. Except for the guy that lost of course. But to be fair, Brawl Stars is 3v3 while as Clash Royale is only 1v1. So it may be more difficult to implement a system like this in Brawl Stars. Although that's only half of the problem. Don't get me wrong, it still sucks because basically in an attempt to stop teaming, Brawl Stars matches players against computers. I don't know about you but I personally don't like winning trophies just because my opponents were bots. But if you don't mind bots in trophy games, how about challenges? There are more challenges now than ever in Brawl Stars and every single one of them is plagued by bots. I don't remember the last time I've played a challenge without seeing bots. For the first few stages, I play against bots 100% of the time. And I promise, I'm not just making this up. It's actually very easy to see if you're playing against a real person or a bot. So what you do is you go into your battle log, then you want to tap one of the profiles on the enemy team. If it's a bot profile, they'll have Shelly as their favorite brawler or another brawler without a skin. They won't be in a club, their battle card will be empty, they won't have any team league rank, and they normally won't have too many brawlers. All those things together is signs of a bot. The second way you can check this is in-game. If it's a bot, they move in a weird way, they randomly change direction when they walk, they don't tend to use gadgets or star powers, and if you're playing Brawl Ball, all three bots rush to the middle to stay together. So you can see it's way easier to identify bots with all the new customization updates. But also, bots just have really dumb names nowadays, like they don't even try anymore. So let me know, are there more bots in Brawl Stars? Or has it just become easier to tell when a player is a bot? 